quickest ways to waterproof a bathtub surround using hydroband sheet membrane as well as a quick and easy way how to waterproof a custom niche using hydroband board with hydroband sealant. So first we frame the niche. Our niche is all framed out. What we do is simple, run some sealant back here, install our custom hydroband niche and then I'll show you how we waterproof this niche. Now we're going to install our gypsum board and waterproof it via hydroband sheet membrane. Okay, our hydroband sheet membrane is pre-cut. We have our back wall here. We will install the back wall horizontally and then we will install the two side walls vertically with about a, a four to five inch overlap onto the back wall. Let's install. And the thin set that will be used to install our waterproof sheet membrane will be multi max light. Let's quickly mix this up. Okay guys, our board is up. Our niche is installed. This is our custom hydro band board niche. Two ways to do this. I usually tend to build the box first and then install after the framing or you can simply do it piece by piece. Install the back first with your sealant, install the sides, the top and the bottom, and then screw off this. What we're gonna do is run our sealant where the seams and penetrations are inside this niche. But first, what we're gonna do is install our hydroband sheet membrane on this back wall and then the side walls with our proper overlap for the waterproof system. I'll be using a V-notch trowel to install with the thin set multi max light. Of course, our hydro band adhesive and sealant that again will be for the seams and penetrations. We will also run a bead underneath our hydro band sheet membrane right here on the edge of this niche to get us a water tight seal. And lastly, we'll run a bead like usual on the flange of this bathtub running our hydro band sheet membrane all the way down to again, provide us a watertight seal down here. And this is what we're gonna use to press and adhere our sealant. This is for the seams. And this cool little $4 corner trowel is for the inside of our niche. Troweling thin set here on this membrane so the top part will overlap two inch minimum. Time to waterproof this niche here. 
seams and penetrations, as well as our sheet membrane. Check it out. Now it's time to waterproof the flange of this bathtub. Let me show you where we're going to install the sealant so that it is watertight. Here is our sheet membrane. We're going to lift this flap up, install our sealant right here on the flange, and then press and adhere so that it is 100% waterproof. Here we go. And there's our thick bead of sealant. All right guys, there you have it. About one hour, waterproof this entire surround with Laticrete Hydroband Sheet Membrane. We waterproof the niche and we waterproof the tub flange. It's ready to go for tile. We start that tomorrow.